Tayforth Machinery is a non-profit making member owned agricultural cooperative. We've got 880 members currently in Fife, Tayside and Centre regions of Scotland. We were started in 1989 and our turnover last year was £11 million. Purpose of a machinery ring is to help its members businesses and be more profitable and more sustainable and we do this by arranging in excess of 10,000 contracts between members every year. And these are in services and hires and labour and commodities and training. And we don't own any of the equipment, it's our members equipment that we contract out. Firstly, the members don't need to buy all the different pieces of equipment that they might need on their farm. They can concentrate on the ones they can fully utilise and contract in the rest. Secondly, they don't have to phone all the different commodity suppliers in order to get the best deal um, because we've already um, done that for them and when they phone in we can make sure that they get the best deal and in fact um, by using the, um, <clears throat> uh, the buying power of the members we can in fact usually get better than they could individually themselves. Without any question, the combination of having an ultra-efficient computer system and our rule of only doing business by direct debit so that the suppliers know exactly when they'll be paid, these are the two um, keys to our success. Our members are farmers, contractors, self-employed um, labour suppliers and um, <clears throat> businesses that would like to supply commodities and services into the agricultural industry. They, they can all become members and all are. We're rightly very proud of this in that um, we always um, have a greater than 95% success rate in matching requests and this means that when a member phones in they um, are can be very confident that we will actually find exactly what it is they need and that tends to make them phone us again. I used to think that was going to be a major problem, but it turns out with geographical differences, with different crops, different areas, different sowing dates, um, it, doesn't, it isn't a problem and in fact with no other equipment, um, a few days is the most anyone will wait for any bit of kit. Well, I can give you an example in combining. Um, if you grow about 200 acres of, um, of cereals and you don't own a combine, um, you could potentially have a real issue at harvest time unless you knew for a fact that you'd be able to contract in the service. And that makes a lot of people buy combines with these small areas and have upwards of £50 an acre combining costs, whereas when they contract it in, it's a fixed £30 an acre. Or in fuel buying, um, when we go and um, sign up members, we so often um, find that they've been buying kerosene at 15 pence per litre more than we can actually get them at and over a year that will be in excess of their annual subscription dramatically and so people can justify their annual subscription on a very small thing like buying kerosene for their house. I've been chairman of Tayforce Machinery since 2005. I farm just outside Dunfermline, a, a unit approximately 950 hectares and we are all combined with crops. I've been a member of the machinery ring now for about 20 years and we use the ring a lot. I find that it is a great way of arranging our work done at a reasonable cost and very quickly. So, I mean, I'm always amazed at how well the ring can respond to a request and even uh, in situations where you think that everyone else is so busy and that there's no way they'd be able to come up with the particular uh, service that you require, I have never been let down. And two examples of this were last harvest where I needed uh, somebody to look after my grain dryer at fairly short notice. Uh, harvest was much later last season and my particular uh, employee was going back to university. So I phoned the ring and I managed to get uh, somebody who just slotted into the job really well, really easily and did a, did a very good job and uh, there was really no hassle and it takes a lot of the pressure off me at a very busy time of year. Um, in fact, in some ways the, the ring system is a bit like an elaborate dating agency where we're matching up members with other members, uh, uh, members who need a service uh, to, to, with members that uh, have a service on offer. Um, 
so it, it, it's a bit like a, a sort of matching up uh, service, that's really at the core of what the ring does. One of the other benefits of the ring is simply as an insurance policy, you may not need to use these services all the time, but you do know that they're there if you need them. And it's, it gives you a bit of peace of mind knowing that if, if it gets really desperate and you have to get stuff done, for instance in a difficult year, you can literally lift the phone and ring the ring. I think more people should be members of the ring because it is a way of connecting a large number of people who have either services to provide or are needing services carried out. And the more people we have in the ring, the more variety of these services we can offer to all of our members. Um, and the, the other reason, of course, is that more uh, members would get the general benefits that the ring uh, has available to offer. The benefits, well, obviously, um, uh, the ring are pricing through several different companies. Uh, for the fuel in particular, but for everything, so uh, there's obviously a financial benefit. We're, we're hoping to pick up the cheapest prices always, without me having to put the physical effort in to go and ring up six companies on my on, on, on bag.